Down a winding path at the bottom of a hill in rural Guatemala, I met Fidelina and her family. She lives with her husband, their three children, and her husband's grandparents. My husband works on a chicken farm, but the money he makes is not enough to support the family. So I have been trying to figure out how to make some extra money. Sometimes I ask my mom if there is any food left because I am still hungry. She says I should content myself with what we have because there is no more. Wilmer is not doing very well in school. His teacher told me he needs vitamins to help him focus. Recently, CBN started an innovative new mushroom farming program here in Chimantalango. The process is simple. Corn cobs are brought in, broken apart, and boiled to kill any bacteria or fungus. Then they're ground and bagged with mushroom spores. Add water, and in a few weeks, a family is ready to harvest its first crop. What I love about this project is that these ladies are taking a byproduct, corn cobs, and they're using it to feed their families and to have a side business, too. <laughs> The women in the village wanted to make me some of their famous mushroom soup. But first, we had to make some tortillas to go with it. OK, I'm starting over. In spite of my lack of tortilla making skills, lunch turned out great. And the mushroom soup was delicious. All the moms said their kids love it. And they love knowing that mushrooms are a good source of vitamins, nutrients, and protein. I like mushroom soup very much. And it fills me up. No more hunger. This mushroom business has made me very happy. I feel so grateful. I know that this business will help my family in many different ways. Thank you, CBN. May God bless you.